Well, cast your mind back to February last year, and you may remember the excitement when NASA successfully landed its Perseverance rover on Mars. Well, it's been busy for the last 15 months or so, doing plenty of roving, and now it's ready for the most important part of the mission, searching for signs of life. NASA's Perseverance rover has just captured the clearest image of what might be actual life on Mars. This could be proof that Mars has more to it than just rocks and dust. What exactly did the rover spot that has everyone talking about life on the red planet? Let us dive into these incredible discoveries and see why this will change everything we know about space. How we learn to explore. NASA's mission to explore Mars is a story of hard work, smart ideas, and slow but steady progress. It really got going more than two decades ago, but the idea of checking out Mars started even earlier. Experience, and it was, uh, it was exciting times, and, and uh, any information you found was valuable, and people were interested in it and looked at it. Back when space travel was just beginning, Mars was thought to be a good place to look for signs of life beyond Earth. However, getting to Mars was tough. Even after we managed to send machines to orbit around Mars, landing on it was another big challenge. That's when the smart idea of sending rovers came about, and it totally changed how we study planets that are far away. The surprises from Mars rovers have been more impressive than anyone expected, and there's a lot more to be amazed by. Before we dive deeper into this incredible mission, it's clear that what we're about to uncover could change our understanding of life beyond Earth forever. And this is just the beginning of the surprises. The first Mars rover, Sojourner, landed on Mars in 1997 as part of NASA's Mars Pathfinder mission. It was small and not very complex, especially compared to what we have now. But back then, it was a big deal. The idea of sending a moving robot to another planet to do experiments seemed like something out of a science fiction book. But Sojourner made it real. During its 83-day mission, it sent back tons of information about the surface of Mars, including pictures and data bus about the soil and rocks. This showed that rovers could work on Mars and open the door for more ambitious missions in the future. After Sojourner showed what could be done, NASA sent up more advanced rovers. In 2004, the twin rovers Spirit and Opportunity landed on Mars. They were meant to explore different parts of the planet, both rovers did way better than expected. Opportunity, in particular, kept sending back information for an incredible 15 years. These rovers made some big discoveries, including finding signs that there used to be liquid water on Mars. Since water is important for life, this was a huge deal. In 2012, the next big step came with the Curiosity rover. Curiosity was bigger and had more tools than any rover before it. Its job was to dig deeper into the Martian surface and find out more about the environment there. It was looking for conditions that might have supported tiny life forms a long time ago. Curiosity found more signs of old water and even some organic materials, which are the basic building blocks of life. Curiosity is still exploring Mars today, sending back new information all the time. The latest and greatest rover from NASA is Perseverance, which landed on Mars in February, 2021. Perseverance isn't just another rover, it's the most advanced one yet. It builds on everything NASA has learned from earlier missions. Perseverance's job is to look for signs of ancient life, collect samples of rocks and soil to send back to Earth one day, and help get everything ready for people to visit Mars in the future. The videos and pictures it has sent back are the clearest and most breathtaking views of Mars we've ever seen. The day Perseverance landed on Mars was a really big deal. It took off from Earth in July 2020 and spent more than six months traveling through space to get to Mars. Its arrival was nerve-wracking. The process, called the Seven Minutes of Terror, involved very precise moves to get through the Martian atmosphere and land safely. This part of the mission was not only super stressful, but also very complicated, with many steps to make sure everything went perfectly. For the first time, this rover had high-definition cameras that recorded every bit of its trip down to Mars. People around the world could watch as it went through the atmosphere, let go of its parachute, dropped its heat shield, and gently landed using a special rocket system. The video of this landing is incredible. 
and shows one of the most complex and daring space maneuvers ever attempted. So what does all this mean for us? Well, every new piece of information we get from Mars helps us understand not just Mars, but also our place in the universe. It's like piecing together a giant space question. Each rover mission teaches us more about Mars's history and brings us closer to the day when humans might walk on the red planet. The thought of stepping on another planet is exciting and a bit scary, but thanks to these rovers, it's becoming more of a possibility. After learning about the amazing start of the Mars rovers, let's explore how these missions have changed. The road to understanding the red planet. NASA's work on Mars shows us how much humans can achieve when we're curious and determined. We've just passed one minute to atmospheric entry, current altitude 121 miles, current velocity 12,084 miles per hour. We are now at an altitude of 73 miles, moving at a speed of 12,192 miles per hour. Expected parachute deploy in five seconds. Each rover that lands on Mars paves the way for new discoveries and gets us closer to answering some really big questions. Was there ever life on Mars? Could there be life out there somewhere else? The answers might still be far off, but thanks to missions like Perseverance, we're moving closer to finding them. The adventure continues and who knows what we'll discover next. The footage from the Mars rover wasn't just for showing off. It was crucial for giving engineers essential data. This helped them figure out how well the landing system worked. The whole process of the rover touching down on Mars was planned with a lot of care. However, dealing with the thin and unpredictable atmosphere of Mars always comes with some uncertainty. Watching the landing happen in great detail has provided NASA with valuable insights. These insights are key to making future space missions even better. As we continue, you'll see how these learnings have improved rover designs and started a new era in the exploration of Mars. After landing safely, the rover began sending back even more footage of the landscape around it. It gave us our first detailed look at Jezero Crater. This site was chosen because scientists think it might have clues about ancient life on Mars. They believe that this crater once held a big lake. The formations that look like river deltas suggest that rivers might have flowed into this lake, bringing sediments that could hold signs of past life. The arrival of this rover on Mars kicked off an exciting new chapter in space exploration. This isn't just because of its scientific goals, but also because it lets us see Mars in ways we've never seen before. The rover is equipped with some of the most advanced cameras ever sent to another planet. The footage they capture is simply amazing. One of the most thrilling parts of this footage is the high definition in which it captures Mars. Previous missions to Mars gave us valuable images and videos, but they were limited by the technology available at the time. Cameras on earlier rovers couldn't show the level of detail or true colors that we see now with Perseverance. The Perseverance rover has 23 cameras, many of which can take images and videos in 4K resolution. This technology allows us to see the Martian surface in incredible detail. It reveals features that were previously difficult to spot or understand. Every rock, ridge, and crater is shown in sharp focus, and the images are so clear you feel like you can almost touch the Martian soil. A fascinating part of this footage is the range of colors. Mars is often called the red planet, but the footage shows it's not just red. The surface actually has many colors, from rusty reds to golden yellows and deep browns. These colors are beautiful, but they also tell us about the planet's geology and history. Different minerals reflect light in different ways. By examining these colors, Scientists can learn more about what Mars's surface is made of and the natural processes that have shaped it. The high-definition footage also provides a better look at the Martian atmosphere. Mars has a very thin atmosphere, mostly made up of carbon dioxide, and it usually looks blurry in pictures taken from space. But the footage from the rover shows the atmosphere in action. We can see dust storms swirling and light winds blowing across the Martian plains. This is the first time we've been able to observe these subtle atmospheric changes as they happen. It gives us a new view of Mars as a dynamic, constantly changing place. One of the most dramatic pieces of footage wasn't captured after the rover landed. It was taken during the rover's descent to Mars. Landing a rover on Mars is a very complex and risky operation, often called the Seven Minutes of Terror. This name comes from the tense series of events that must happen perfectly and quickly 
to ensure a successful landing. In those seven minutes, the rover had to slow down from nearly 12,000 miles per hour as it entered the Martian atmosphere. It used a supersonic parachute to slow down further. Then it relied on thrusters and a rocket-powered sky crane to gently land. Every stage of this process was crucial. If anything had gone wrong, the rover could have crashed into Mars, ending the mission before it even started. With every new discovery, we learn more about Mars and our place in the universe. So let's focus on the exciting footage. Watching a rover land on Mars. What's incredible about this footage is that it shows us the descent in real time, something never captured so clearly before. Watching it allows us to see the complex steps of landing on Mars as they happen. This footage is not just important for NASA's US engineers who use it to improve landing techniques. It also brings everyone on Earth closer to the challenges of exploring space. It's a clear example of human ingenuity in our ongoing quest to understand more about the universe. This real-time footage helps people everywhere feel connected to the adventures and challenges of space exploration. It demonstrates the complexity and excitement of sending a rover to Mars. By showing us every moment of the descent, it captures the attention and awe of anyone watching, making the experience of landing on Mars feel more real and immediate. Every new image and video we get from Mars helps us learn more about this distant world. We see the planet's features up close, watch its weather change, and even start to understand its history. Each mission builds on the previous one using better technology and gathering more data. This continual improvement is what makes ongoing exploration possible. NASA's continued efforts on Mars show how much we can achieve when we're driven by curiosity and determination. Each successful rover landing opens up more opportunities to discover and explore. While we still have many questions about Mars, each mission brings us closer to the answers. With advanced technology like that on the Perseverance rover, who knows what we'll discover next? As we keep watching and learning, the story of Mars continues to unfold, always bringing new surprises and insights. As we witness the heat shield part ways, a parachute opens up, and the captivating view of the Martian surface comes into focus. We're right there with the robot as it makes its descent to the planet's surface. This rare and exhilarating glimpse into space exploration is something most folks don't get to see every day. So brace yourself, we're about to see Mars like never before. Each photo taken from the Jezero crater is set to unveil more about this old planet. Imagine being one of the engineers at NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory during this moment. You could almost feel the room's tension as they await the rover's safe landing. When it finally happens, the relief and joy aren't just for the engineers, but for all of us watching. This event isn't just another day at the office. It's a historic moment in space exploration that'll be remembered for ages. Right after touching down, the robot gets busy. It starts right away, sending back photos and videos, showing us and the world the first looks at Jezero Crater. This area was chosen for landing because it's thought to have been filled with water once, which makes it a perfect spot to look for signs of life that might have existed long ago. The footage from Jezero Crater is absolutely stunning. Surrounded by cliffs and ridges, the crater is rich with large deposits of sediment that might tell us about Mars's wet past. In some of the videos, you can see the old riverbeds that used to flow into the crater, now dry and weathered. These are hints that Mars was once very different, filled with flowing water and maybe even a climate that could have supported life. Mars is a planet of many faces, as shown by the robot's footage. From sharp, jagged rocks and massive boulders to expansive, dusty plains, Mars showcases a variety of landscapes. Some areas are blanketed with fine dust and sand, while others are scattered with sharp rocks that seem to have been broken apart by some great force long ago. The craters on Mars are particularly fascinating. The planet is dotted with craters of all sizes, made by asteroids and comets hitting the surface over millions of years. Each crater has its own story, revealing bits about the planet's past. Thanks to the robot, we get a close-up look at these craters in incredible detail. Some show signs of water erosion, suggesting they were formed when water was present on Mars, while others look newer and untouched, documenting more recent collisions. As we keep exploring Mars, we need to face the tough realities of the planet and see how these challenges help us search for signs of past life. The Harsh Beauty of Mars 
Despite the beauty of Mars, the footage also reminds us of how tough and unforgiving the planet is. The thin atmosphere offers little shield from the sun's harsh radiation, and night temperatures can plunge to minus 100 degrees Celsius. The footage paints a picture of a barren, empty world without any signs of life or greenery. It feels both strange and somewhat familiar, highlighting the tough challenges that lie ahead for humans who might one day visit Mars. One of the major goals of this robot mission is to find signs of ancient microbial life. Though Mars appears cold and barren now, it's believed that it used to be more like Earth, with rivers, lakes, and maybe even oceans billions of years ago. If there was life during that more welcoming time, it's the rover's job to find evidence of it. The video and images sent back by the robot are crucial in this search. By carefully studying the terrain, scientists can figure out the best spots that might have old signs of life, like rock formations that could have trapped fossils. The rover is equipped with special tools to collect samples of Martian rock and soil, which will eventually make their way back to Earth for more thorough analysis. One promising spot for finding such evidence is the Jezero Crater, where the rover is currently exploring. It's thought that this crater was once a large lake, and the patterns in the terrain suggest rivers used to flow into it, bringing along sediments that might hold evidence of past life. By examining the sediment layers, scientists hope to find clues about the planet's history and whether it could have supported life. This mission to Mars isn't just about taking pictures and videos, it's about piecing together the history of another world. Every bit of data we get helps us understand if Mars could have been a home to life forms, how its climate has changed, and how it turned into the cold desert it is today. It's like putting together a giant cosmic question, where each piece brings us closer to understanding not just Mars, but potentially other planets as well. So as we follow this robot's path across the Martian landscape, we're not just spectators, we're part of a bigger quest to understand our place in the universe. It's an adventure that could reshape our understanding of life beyond Earth. As we explore from millions of miles away, through the lens of a rover, Mars becomes a little less of a distant red dot in the sky and more of a world that might once have been a lot like our own. Each new discovery on Mars edges us closer to a big question. Could Mars have once supported life? This question drives the exploration of the planet, pushing us to dig deeper and explore further. Looking for signs of life on Mars is one of the most crucial scientific tasks of our time. If the rover uncovers signs of ancient life, it would confirm that life once existed on Mars. This would not just be a monumental discovery for Mars. It would suggest that life might be common across the universe. This kind of discovery would turn our understanding of life's beginnings and our place among the stars upside down. The images we get from Mars are amazing, but they also show us how tough the planet is. Mars's surface is freezing, dry and empty, with not a single sign of life as we know it. The pictures show a place that is both stunning and lonely, with high cliffs, big flat lands, and rocky areas that go on as far as we can see. One of the biggest hurdles in exploring Mars is its very thin atmosphere, which is mostly made up of carbon dioxide. This thin air makes it hard for rovers and other equipment to work well because there's almost no air to help them move or stay up. The images from the robot show a dusty, windy Mars with tiny bits of sand and dust moving across the planet all the time. The temperatures on Mars are also a huge challenge. During the day, the temperature might go up to a mild 20 degrees Celsius, but at night it drops down to below minus 100 degrees Celsius. These wild swings in temperature put a lot of pressure on the rover's systems. The equipment needs to be managed very carefully to make sure it keeps working in such extreme conditions. Now that we've looked at the wonders and challenges of Mars, Let's discover the new inventions that are changing space exploration. Ingenuity takes flight on Mars. Despite these difficulties, the images from the Perseverance rover give us valuable information about the environment on Mars. By studying the planet's weather and how it changes, scientists can learn more about Mars's past climate and how it might change in the future. This information is really important for planning more missions, especially ones that might include people. The images also highlight how important it is to build rovers that can handle Mars's tough conditions. Perseverance has advanced systems to control its temperature and protect itself from radiation and other space conditions. 
allowing it to work in one of the most unfriendly places in our solar system. This is a real proof of human skill and cleverness, and it shows the big challenges of exploring other planets. One of the most exciting parts of the Perseverance mission is the small helicopter called Ingenuity. This tiny light drone was sent to Mars with the rover to see if powered flight is possible in Mars's thin air. If it works, Ingenuity could change the way we explore Mars, allowing scientists to look at places the rovers can't reach and see the planet from above. After Perseverance landed, Ingenuity was set up and successfully completed its first flight on April 19, 2021. This was a big moment in history. It was the first time an aircraft flew on another planet. The videos taken by Perseverance of Ingenuity's flight are captivating. They show the little helicopter going up into the air, hovering for a few seconds, and then landing safely back on the ground. Ever since its inaugural flight, the Ingenuity helicopter has embarked on multiple additional sorties, each growing bolder than the one before. These missions provide us with a fresh perspective of Mars, enabling scientists to observe the red planet's terrain from the skies, a viewpoint that was previously unachievable. Ingenuity has soared over rugged landscapes, sweeping sand dunes, and various challenging terrains. This aerial reconnaissance delivers crucial insights that inform the route and objectives for the Perseverance rover as it navigates the Martian surface. The achievements of Ingenuity have surpassed NASA's initial expectations and have paved the way for the future of space exploration. These successes hint at a future where even more sophisticated drones could play a pivotal role in Martian discovery. Such advanced drones would be instrumental in creating detailed maps of Mars's surface, pinpointing ideal locations for subsequent missions to land and explore further. The collaboration between Perseverance and Ingenuity represents a significant technological triumph and offers a glimpse into the potential future of planetary exploration. This partnership is pushing the boundaries of what we believe is achievable, and the continual stream of data and footage captured by these machines provides ongoing inspiration to scientists and engineers around the globe. It serves as a powerful reminder that our exploration of the cosmos is just in its infancy, with Mars playing a key role in this expansive adventure. Watching these robots and drones at work on Mars connects us to something bigger than just technological feats. We are participants in a broader quest to determine whether life exists elsewhere in the universe beyond our home planet. Every new data point, every fresh image we receive helps us stitch together the narrative of Mars, a planet that might have once shared similarities with Earth. This quest for knowledge isn't solely about reaching uncharted territories. It's about deepening our understanding of our place within the vast expanse of the universe. Well, Ingenuity lifted off, hovered about 10 meters above the surface, and then landed. As Ingenuity continues to fly across the Martian skies and perseverance rolls across its surface, we are reminded of the limitless possibilities that await. These missions could lead to discoveries that redefine our understanding of life in the universe. They might even answer the age-old question of whether life is a singular phenomenon unique to Earth or a widespread occurrence across the cosmos. Furthermore, the technological innovations developed for these missions contribute to our ability to survive and explore in harsh environments. They test our engineering capabilities and challenge us to innovate in ways that benefit not just space exploration, but also life back on Earth. The knowledge gained from operating drones like Ingenuity could lead to advancements in robotics and remote sensing that impact various industries, from agriculture to disaster response. As we venture forward, the partnership between drones like Ingenuity and rovers like Perseverance may become the blueprint for exploring other planets. Just imagine drones scouting ahead in alien atmospheres or rovers collecting samples from other worlds, all working together in a synchronized dance of exploration and discovery. This exploration of Mars acts as a bridge between the known and the unknown. With each flight that Ingenuity completes and each foot that Perseverance travels, we gather more clues about Mars's past, including whether it could have supported life. These clues are pieces of a larger question that extends beyond Mars, touching upon the fundamental nature of life itself. Could this image truly be evidence of life on Mars, or is there another explanation that NASA isn't telling us? Let us know your thoughts, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more.